Well, after more than four decades, a mainline record shop is closing its doors. The owners are making sure the music keeps going. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance has the story in Bryn Mawr. We're kind of stuck in the 70s. We're just it kind of in our own rut, a happy rut. We felt the records had a better sound. Harold Gold knows music. This is the main alphabet for the rock and roll category. The former record label exec traded his title for a chance to run his own record store on the main line. I bought the business and thought we'd last about a year. That was 1976. And with the help of his wife and co-owner, Maximilian Gold Million Records, formerly Plastic Fantastic, which specializes in vintage music and memorabilia from nostalgic bands from the 60s, 70s, and 80s, has lasted 42 years. Great, crazy memories. That's Blondie on my birthday. I got a birthday kiss. That's me. This is Joan Jett and the Runaways. There's Joan. Philadelphia area native and Rock and Roll Hall of Famer, Joan Jett was one of many celebrity artists who made appearances over the decades. This is the Ramones. This is uh, March 8th, 1980 mm -hmm. at our Bryn Mawr store. His historic walls will soon empty as the couple announce their retirement and that they're selling all of their stock on eBay for $50,000. Definitely a lot of phone calls and some interest. That's tough. That's, that's happy and sad for both of us, and we've had a great run. Harold and Max hope to sell all of their stock by the end of next month. They're hoping to close this shop for good on Thanksgiving Day because it's the 42-year anniversary of the day the shop opened. In Bryn Mawr, Shantae Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.